Hello everyone, I am Siti Nasiha from 10th standard. Today I am delivered about Malala Yousaf Sai. As an angle, Malala Yousaf Sai defeated the Taliban in Pakistan and demanded that girl be allowed to receive an education. She was shot head by Taliban in gunman in 2012 but survived. She was the youngest person to receive the Nobel Peace Prize. Who is Malala Yousaf Sai? Yousaf Sai is Pakistan education advocate who at the age of 17 in 2014 became the youngest person to win the Nobel Peace Prize. Peace Prize. After surviving an assassination attempt by Taliban, Yusuf Sai became advocate for girls' education when she herself still was child, which resulted in a Taliban issuing a death threat against her. On October 9, 2012, she gunman shot Yusuf Sai when she was travelled home from school. She survived and had continued to speak on importance of education. In 2013, she gave a speech to United Nations and published her first book, I Malala, Early Life. Yusuf Sai was born on July 12, 19. 1997, Mingora, Pakistan, country located in Swath Valley. For the first few years of her life, Yusuf Sai hometown remained popular tourist spot that no forward summer festival. The area began to change as Taliban tried to take control. Yus education activist Yusuf Sai attended school that her father educator Ziauddin Yusuf Sai had found. After Taliban began attacking school, attacking girls' school in Swath, Yusuf Sai continued to speak. Give, gave a speech to United Nations in Peshawar, Pakistan to September 2008. The title of her talk was, How Dare the Taliban to Take Away My Basic Right to Education. In early 2009, she was just 11 years old, Yusuf Sai began blogger BBC about underliving Taliban threats to her Denny Air education. In order to hide her identity, she used the name Galma Kai. However, she was revealed to be the blogger BBC in December of that year. With a growing public platform, Yusuf Sai gave it, continued to speak about her rights and rights of all women and education. Her research activists were nominated for International Children's Peace Prize 2011. In that same year, Yusuf Sai awarded Pakistan National Youth Peace Prize. Yusuf Sai and her family learned about Taliban issued had death threats against her because of activism. Though Yusuf Sai was frightened for the safety of her father, of her father, anti-Taliban activist, she and her family initially felt that fundamental group would not harm a child. Malala Day. In 2013, Yusuf Sai gave a speech to United Nations Secretary General Ban Ki Moon's pronounced July 12 Yusuf Sai birthday. Malala Day, honor of young leader activist to ensure education for all children at announced Bansit Award. In October 2013, the Euro Parliament award Yusuf Sai the Sakharov Prize for the freedom of thought in acknowledgement of her her work. In 2014, Yusuf Sai became the youngest person to receive the Nobel Peace Prize. At just 17 years old, she received an award along with Indian children's rights activist Kailash Shatyarthi. Yusuf Sai was first nominated for Nobel 2013, but she did not win. She was renominated in March 2014, Yusuf Sai is Pakistani Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif said. She is pride of Pakistan. She made her country men proud. Her achievement unparalleled unequaled girls and boys of the world should take lead from her struggle and commitment to former UN Secretary General Ban Ki Moon described Yusuf Sai as a brave, gentle love who is though sample act going to school become a global teacher. Malala Fund. In 2013, Yusuf Sai and her father launched a fund which work to ensure girls around the world the world accept 12 years of free safety quality education the fund prioritizes assistance to Gal galma kai network as a reference to the pseudonym use of sai when used when she wrote the bbc blogger about life in pakistan life in pakistan uh, under Taliban rule. This country including Afghanistan, Brazil, Lebanon, India, Nigeria, Turkey and Pakistan or where most girls miss out on secondary education on her 18th birthday, July 2015. Yusuf Sai continued to take action on, on global education by opening school for Syrian refugee girls in Lebanon. It covered by Malala Fund. At school was designed to admit nearly 200 girls from age of 14 to 18. Today on my first day on adult of behalf of the world children demanded a leader we must invest in books instead of bullets. Yusuf Sai proclaimed the one of the school classroom 
that is she wrote on malala fan website the books i malala the, the girl who stood up for education is uh, was shot by taliban is an autobiography of malala yousafzai is released 2018 it become the international best seller uh, it, the book was abridged in 2018 for young book chapter the reader is malala my story is stand up for girls rights college yousafzai began studying at oxford university in 2017 graduating on june 2020 uh, degree of philosophy politics economics i am also receive i am also honored to receive this award along with uh, together kaila shatyati who has been the champion children of the world for a long time twice along in fact that i have been that i have been alive and i i will glad that we can stand together and show the world the india and pakistan we can united in peace and together work for the children's rights so dear brothers and sisters i was named after inspirational pastor john of arc malala of my one the word malala means grief stricken sad but uh, order to lend some happy words to it my grandfather would always call me malala the happiest girl in the world the happiest girl in the world and that today i'm very happy that we can stand together in on important cause i am here to raise them to stand up for this it is not to time pity them it is time to take action so it become the last time we can see child depression on education thank you